just uh, taking the dog for a walk through the park. It's currently the off leash hours, so <laughs> I, I, I can let so, so I can let him run free for a bit. But uh, we'll just make sure he doesn't he doesn't venture. To Blackberries. I don't mind if I do. It's starting to ripen, ripen up. We can tell they're ripe because they come off real easy. The red ones aren't ripe yet, but the black ones are. Beautiful. Any good? Any luck? Good morning. I went for a 22k hills ride at 7.45 a.m. And on that ride, I bought lemon sugar water and I had some of it on the ride and then the rest when I got home. It had 115 grams of sugar with a squeezed lemon and topped with 600 mils of water. So I've just done a bit of tidying and now I'm going to have some of this red crisp looking melon. I will have half of it because then I am going to go walking around the hood looking for figs because we're coming into fig season and I'm thinking they will be ripe now. They look amazing. So I'm going to go out exploring before the UV cranks up to extreme, like past 13, which is how it is every day. And uh, it's going to be about 35 degrees Celsius. So some melon and then fig hunting. I'll let you know how it goes. Juicy. Yeah. These will probably go through to March. The figs do need another few days. Fortunately, it's going to be a very hot week. We've got like 37 for the next four days, I think. So that will soften them up and bring out that full sugar content. I had three and they were still good, but they're going to be cranking next week. Look at the size of this vacant blog. Full sun. That would create an amazing orchard. Imagine all of the fruits and veggies you could grow.